Hey, what's up everybody? Corn Kid here. What's going on? Um, it is April 14th. Wow, it's the 14th already. Um, just here with a Blu-ray update. And this past Friday was my birthday, so I, the week before last, this past Friday, went to go see Captain America. Um, it was awesome. And then I went to go see it again the next day, because it was even more awesomer. First time, not that much. Uh, I had a special ed adult that talked through the entire movie, sat right next to me, and his mother was there, and she talked through the entire movie too. So it wasn't that great of an experience. So my buddies Bash Peacemaker and the Almighty, Almighty Taco uh, took me to see Captain America, uh, the Winter Soldier again the next day. So that was really, really cool. Um, anyway, um, these are a couple of my Blu-rays that uh, I wanted to show you. Um, <clears throat> hope you enjoy. <laughs> okay, first one. Am I doing it right? There we go. Yeah. Uh, as you can tell, Ron Burgundy, um, Anchorman 1 and 2, Steelbook Edition. Right there. Whoops, sorry. Anchorman 1 and 2. Um, you can get this at Walmart. Um, it's pretty cheap. So, really, really cool. Um, the only thing is, is that the little plastic uh, hooks, uh, one of them broke off, unfortunately, but uh, it's not that bad. So, okay. Actually, let me put these here. Predator 3D. Is that cool or what? Hunter. Target. Hunter. Target. This is the back right here. Got this at Best Buy. And then Machete, part one. Danny Trio. Really cool. I haven't, I've never seen that actually. Um, this one, this, I got, some of these I got a couple weeks ago. So, uh, this is one of them. Uh, Gravity. I am so upset that I missed this in the theaters in 3D, but really great film. Really cool. Then Akira on Blu-ray. I did not understand the ending whatsoever, but uh, the movie was friggin' badass as hell. Robocop. Um, director's Cut Unrated Edition. Really, really awesome. Um, if you guys want the original, this is it right here. This is the original. The first one on Blu-ray. I didn't get the collector's edition because I didn't want the uh, 2 and 3. And then obviously Ghostbusters. Classic. Rest in peace, Harold Remus. Mm -mm. Then Joss Whedon's Much Ado About Nothing. Um, it has every person possibly he could cast from his uh, Whedon verse. So Nathan Fillion, Daniel uh, Clark Gregg from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., who is a fantastic leading actor. I didn't know that he could be such a great leading actor. Um, <clears throat> and who else? Oh, God, the other guy from Firefly. Um, obviously Nathan Fillion, but it was Sean Mayer. He is a fantastic villain in this. This is uh, old Shakespeare. Um, I was watching it. Um around midnight and I was really tired so I didn't really understand so I popped it back in again I really really enjoyed this film um, pick it up it takes a couple minutes just to see what uh, like where everything is um, just to understand it so it may take a, a second viewing but it's a really really good uh, good movie really cool um, Lay of Schreiber Last Days on Mars. I saw this on the uh, internet as an ad, and I enjoyed Leaf Schreiber. Um, it was good. It was cool. Um, nothing really special, but a uh, really cool film. And then a couple days ago, I got Stay. I got this. Argo, the collector's edition. Um, I never saw it in uh, theaters, but uh, everybody was talking about it, so I picked this up. So, looking forward to seeing this. Collector's Edition. Oh boy. I am old. Then we have a triple pack. You can get this at Best Buy. 
Is it Best Buy? No, Walmart. I'm sorry, Walmart for like twelve dollars. Goonies, The Gremlins, and Gremlins 2, the new batch. So I highly, highly recommend this. Um, you can get three movies for the price of like one, basically. And they're great movies, guys. They're really great movies. And I'm probably going to get some uh, flack for this. Um, Daredevil, director's cut. Um, saw it in the theater. A, I give it a 3 out of 10. This, I give a 7 out of 10. It was like uh, The Crow. It reminded me of The Crow mixed with uh, Batman from the 80s Batman. And uh, mixed with Frank Miller because he wanted to do uh, Daredevil. He did Daredevil. Um, but uh, Ben Affleck is Batman. Uh, this reassured me he's going to do a good job as Batman. Um, I'm saying it right now. He can pull Batman off easily. Um, I know he gets a lot of crap for this movie, but uh, the theatrical version sucked. This was a lot better. Is this unrated? I think it was unrated. Um, open it up. Yeah, I think this is unrated. Director's Cut was great. And then, last but not least, I cannot believe I found this. It was a freaking fluke. Me and my buddy Sean, uh, we were at Best Buy, and... We're just looking at the old movies, old cartoons, and then I saw this, and I said, why isn't this on Blu-ray? This sucks. You know, I have All Dogs Go to Heaven on Blu-ray. They finally put that out. Secret of Nim, I still have to get on Blu-ray, but why can't they put this classic out? And then I go to another aisle, and I find it, the last one on Blu-ray. Um, this is how old I am, guys. I'm 31, but I remember seeing this in theaters. That's how old I am, and I, I saw the sequel in theaters, too. I remember seeing this in, in theaters, so bam, an American tale. Right? Right? You're like, oh my god. You're probably thinking, why did you get that? But I'm reliving my childhood. What can I say? Uh, <clears throat> it's finally out. <clears throat> this is legit um, Blu-ray. It's not a copy or anything like that. So... Ah, wow, I didn't know that could happen. <laughs> the uh, little booklet thing came out a little bit. Okay. <laughs> cool. Oh, joy. But yeah, guys, um, let me get that back in there. There we go. Okay. So yeah, um, the colors are brighter. Uh, screw the DVD edition. You can get this on, you can get this on Amazon for like, 10 bucks. I got this for 12 on, on uh, at Best Buy, but I had to get it. I didn't even know it was out on Blu-ray. Um, now, come on, uh, Dumb Bluth and, and uh, Universal, just put out uh, Land Before Time on Blu-ray, please. Please, for the love of God, just knock it out of the park. You're on third base right now. Just make it a home run and put out the first Land Before Time movie on Blu-ray uh, this year, hopefully, because... Um, Come on. This was awesome. This was fantastic that, that this happened. So just knock it out of the park. Don't don't quit like Pete and Pete. Just keep doing it. You, you got one more in you. Just put out Land Before Time on Blu-ray. <laughs> and I can die a happy man. <laughs> Where's my cat? Waffles. There's Waffles. There goes Waffles. Crackhead. It's my boy. Anyway, um, that's it, guys. Let me know what you think of my Blu-rays. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. Um, let me see your guys' collection. Um, I'm always looking at collections and stuff for uh, Blu-rays. So, yeah. Um, let me know what uh, Blu-rays you got and all that. All right. Take care, guys. Bye.